hello welcome to my youtube channel today i'll be showing you how to make some brown from scratch this is my soybeans and my millet this is my guinea corn and my corn so first of all i'll be removing the dirt from all this so i'll move the dirt from my millet my corn and my guinea corn to make this food for my six month old baby so this food is very healthy it's very nutritious for any baby so i'll be adding crayfish and also my dates in it okay these are optional but if you wanted to test to be tastier you had your dates and crayfish to it so this had in the things i'm using there are six in total so i started by boiling the soybeans for 45 minutes for it to be soft in order for me to remove the back so i had to wash it remove the back separate the back from the flesh so this is it <laughs> next thing i'm going to put it on my fry pan and roast it fry it dry make sure all the water comes out of it you know so this is the water so i make sure everything is dry so i'm just going to leave it there turn it stir it until it's brown this way make sure you stir it don't make it burnt this is okay this is perfect so once it's brown and it's not burnt you remove it and keep it make it cool off okay next i'm going to be roasting my guinea corn so i'm going to be doing this process for all the ingredients i'll be using for this tom brown it's raining heavily here yeah? <laughs> if you can hear it at the background you know what i'm saying so this is it i'm just going to roast it and once it's dry and it start popping a little you can see the little pop you can take it out of the gas next you turn your corn you mustn't do it the way i'm doing it you can just um, roast it in any hole that you want to take this is the corn and then i'll roast my corn for until it's looking browny i i don't just let it pop up before i remove it now it's okay for me to remove once it's this dry and it has not stopped popping up it's good for me to remove it this way so this is perfect next is my millet i'm going to be roasting it for it to be dry so once it's dry i'm going to be taking it out please do where to give this video a thumbs up as you can see it's already popping out so it's dry already next is my crayfish i did this in order for it to give it a nice aroma it's not necessary so next i'm going to mix everything together my date is not available yet so i saw it while i was going to blend in the miller that was why i saw the date and i had to add it in it to it okay i didn't see dates all this why so but later i saw dates so after blending it this month i'm going to be filtering it removing the shaft from the main food that is the shaft from the tom brown so i'll make sure i remove everything i'll be the process until everything is done please give this video a thumbs up do where to subscribe to the channel like and share to your friends share to new mothers for them to learn the skill because it's very necessary for you to learn it so i will put this process for all the tom brown that i've already blended so this is so that the baby will not choke so the shaft has to go out of it it's very smooth this way and it's good for babies healthy food for your child from six months and above even adults can take this this is the shaft you can see how rough it is you can't eat this you know <laughs> i have to give it to the chicken to eat 
so this is the final process this is a shaft I gave it to a chicken to eat the Christmas chicken <laughs> and this is the Tom Brown okay this is how it is there's a final stage so next I'll be doing is to make it for my baby to eat give this video a thumbs up share to your friends and subscribe to my channel yeah you can see I'm going to be having milk and voila very tasty my child love it <laughs> bye bye thank you <laughs>